What is up? What is up? It's your boy Danny British man, and I'm about to go hop in the whip. Kid, a kid, a kid, a kid, a kid, a kid, a kid. That's how they wanted me to live. <laughs> Nigga, I work for mine. They wanted, they wanted me to roll down the street in that, but instead I'm rolling in this. <laughs> I even drive my cars, blah. Anyway, guys, how y'all doing, man? <laughs> man, I am freaking on my way to my very first child. So it's my first child with my first love. <laughs> Bitches, I'm in heart attack now. <laughs> my first child, my first love. And here's why she's my first love. She's the one having my first child. How are you gonna love someone more than the person having your first child? It's, it's fucking impossible. Because no matter how deep our relationship was, <laughs> bitch, yeah, yeah, you never had my, yeah, you never had a child. <laughs> so, in my life, you ain't shit. Like when we back in, like when we old and everything and they're looking back, they're like, so he's amazing doctor. Who is the mother? It's not you, bitch. <laughs> but anyway, first child, first appointment that I'm attending due to the pandemic, which funny enough, I think I'm able to go in today. I'm not sure I'm gonna try. Um, Cause I know the place is locking back down due to the fucking Delta virus. You know what I mean? Is it funny how you have these fucking cocksuckers, they can, release this virus no one get arrested no one gets blamed you know why because the government let me not say what i'm about to say you know what i want to stay in the house so let me not complain about the people who built it so let me just shut the fuck up and stay up in this house up in here so it's my first time uh, going in to basically my baby's appointment, right? My two babies, right? I got my girl, she's gonna get checkup, and I have my daughter, she's gonna get checkup. And I'm the loving six figure dad is gonna be up in here looking like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They don't even know I got the Range the best looking Range Rover in the parking lot belong to us. I should say you purchased by me. That's right. Most of you niggas driving around in cars that you bitches perfect purchase. <laughs> but anyway, so we're now taking our lovely self to this um, medical facility to see what's going on. And fully insured. Why? Because I'm a software engineer. Duh. I get full health insurance, full vision insurance. What else type of insurance I get? I just got what you don't got. Just know that. So now we're gonna go in there. We're all we're almost at the location. You know what I forgot to do? Smoke before I went in. So they might get a more animated, raw, uncut version of me. Yeah. I might tell the nurse that WebMD is smarter than her. Yeah. Um, I'm just kidding. I'm not an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an anus hole. Oh, anus hole. Oh. Most of you are kindergarten dropouts. You don't even know what anus is. That's an ass. A-S-S, anus, A-N-U-S. You motherfuckers probably can't spell. Anyway, man, I'm done fucking around, bro. I'm gonna go put on my Gucci Guilty. <laughs> Gucci Guilty in the Range Rover on my Burberry shirt. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's right. I gotta flex on these broke bitches like Rick and Shark Boss. I gotta, especially you, Shark Boss. You used to sell get up in Jamaica for a living boy. Huh, boy? <laughs> well, boy, 
You're just a little mailman now, an unpaid one too. <laughs> hey, Sharp Boss, this is how you step out of a Range Rover. Let me show you. You gotta pull the door. You gotta step out like this. Look, it's the Range Sharp Boss, this is, our, this is how a Range Rover door closes. Look, you just rest it like this, Sharp Boss. Look at that. Closes itself, Sharp Boss. You wouldn't know, you, you can't afford these type of luxury. Wasn't made for you, buddy. Nigga. Anyway, I'm at the hospital, about to go check on my beautiful daughter, who is well taken care of by her dad, her software engineering dad. Look at me, look at me. Oh, and the pink represents her. Oh, look at that $800 VVS diamond nose ring. Oh, oh, oh. And I got like $200 worth of earring on each ear. I'm like a rapper out here. I'm just flexing. A software engineer flexing. Uh, big nerd. I'm waiting on the doctors. My girl said it's private. Not a private. privacy. Yes, yeah. you can. Okay. So, I did the best I seriously could on the appointment. So. Okay. Guys, so we're all done, completo. I'm about to hit the road. Oh. Thank you. And this is the duck, right? Yeah, Thank you. Mm, that's not curry sauce, does it though? Yeah. I'm there, I know. After the um be able to visit. See what I'm saying? Let out the eye ear cause you know what I mean? Eye ear is still kind of wet though. Mm -hmm. Eye ear is still kind of wet. Eye ear too long now. Yo. Come get some food you know. Yo. Feel the eye system you know. Celebrate a healthy baby you know. Yeah man. Yo. I'm at this park, man. This park bring back memories, yo. Mm -hmm. One of my biggest memories of this park was 20, 2019. I'm at this park. Rolling a fucking spliff. Me and a senior software engineer. And he's like, man, what's going on, man? I've got a call. I'm like, what do you mean you got a call? He's like, I got a call. <laughs> so you're going, you're acting crazy. I'm like, do I look like I'm acting crazy? <laughs> Damn, man. He's like, no. Mm -mm. I'm like, what you see me doing, man? He's like, you're rolling, you're playing with something in your hand. I'm like, oh, yeah. Making me one, man. I'm not acting crazy. I just got back from the dispensary. I just spent $150 at the dispensary. Do I look like I'm acting crazy? <laughs> so I'm laughing, right? You tell me why. I see a sheriff SUV pulling up. Then I see a fucking shit, like a police car pulling up. Then I see a fucking white unmarked car pulling up. Then I see another white unmarked car. Then I see another SUV pulling up. I see another fucking black car pulling up. I'm like, I said to the guy, man, you know, these guys are here for me. <laughs> Yo, I just knew. 
these freaking cups came for me, man. I was like, damn. Mm. So, you know, I'm there. I got rid of what was in my hand. Mind you, I just spent 80 bucks on that item. Just that one item. <laughs> Fucking. <bro. laughs> to the ground. Held my composure. The cop came up. The cop is like, are you such and such? I'm like, yes, officer. It's like, well, we got report that you're, um, you're making threats and you're suicidal. I'm like, suicidal? Making threats? I'm like, officer, I'm here. I'm an engineer. I'm here with <laughs> God bless the universe. I'm here with my fellow software engineer. It's, and my guy was like, yeah, you know, we're just here talking, you know. I'm like, yeah, I'm not acting crazy. So, you know, me and the officer is talking. The officer is like, you sound like a guy who have your head on your body. You know, just because the report we get, you're just going to have to make an emergency um, stop at the psychiatric evaluation. <laughs> I'm like, really? They're like, yeah, because, you know, we don't want to leave. And then, you know, we hear that, hey, you do something crazy. I'm like, okay, fine. So senior software engineer next to me was like, all right, I'll make the call. So they Googled the number, made the call. come. Googled the number, made the call. So the engineer told the cop he would drive me to the freaking hospital to get evaluated <laughs> bro you tell me why i go in right the fucking guy that is supposed to do the evaluation is in a wheelchair so i'm like yo why are you in a wheelchair man <laughs> he told me someone was drinking driving he did i'm like that son of a bitch <laughs> he's like yeah i know right you know but what what can he do man I don't sit and I mope about it. I be like, I will be moping like a motherfucker, man. You can't even fuck. <laughs> he didn't know I was going to be so blunt and so real. This guy was like, bro, man, don't even talk about it. I still get upset to this day. And I'm like, yeah, you have all the right to be upset. She, I'd be upset too, my damn self, that happened to me. So we start talking about his life and what he had going on before the accident. You know, his plans afterward. So mind you, I didn't do any fucking evaluation. I was just there talking to these guys. And then I'm like, you know, man, I'm all right, man. He's like, yeah, yeah you seem pretty fine to me. <laughs> He's like, yeah. I'm like, man, I can't leave now, right? He's like, yeah. Mm. You know, is there anything you're sad about? Like... Do you feel like you want to harm yourself right now? I'm like, ah, let me look at myself. Nah, man, you see how, bro, this is Burberry, bro. <laughs> I definitely don't want to harm myself, bro. I can get, like, any girl I want, bro. What the hell, bro? Harm myself? Bro, I got a freaking S. Six outside. <laughs> I don't harm my. He's like, oh, yeah, that's a nice car. I'm like, yep, yep, yep. Boom. So, yeah, I didn't get it. I didn't get evaluated, and um, freaking, what else happened? So I left that that area. I fucking left that area, and yeah. So I freaking left that area. Booked myself into an eight hundred dollars a night hotel for like three days and just chill got me a nice massage and that was it back to my life so that that part bring back memories big fat fish oh